Why are we so quiet tonight? I was shocked. I was stunned. No one wants to hear about their closest friends going through something like this. I think it was too close to home. It's not the most pleasant of topics. What do you want me to say? That the whole thing scares the shit out of me? Well, it does, okay? It me too. You think you're safe on solid ground and then all of a sudden the earth crashes beneath you. I think it's Claudia. I don't want to see her. Tell her I'm going to bed. Amy, please don't leave me alone with her. I'm sorry when I said let her to take those pills. Don't apologize to me. I can tell you things about Blake. Things that could give you a little perspective on this. I don't know what I think of you, Claudia. I honestly don't. Maybe, maybe you should just go to bed. Maybe I should. What are you even doing here? Haven't you done enough? Why does everyone keep asking me that? Rebecca, Blake is no angel. Yet tonight she lies in a hospital suffering. You still defend her? I will defend anyone who cries for help. And downing a ton of sleeping pills is a cry for help. I've been through that kind of trauma and I will always help if I can. Claudia, we heard something about the hospital, but you wanted to have a conversation with Blake? Settle a score? Rebecca, she crossed us, and she needed to hear it from me. One minute we were all at the party, you two were just laughing it up, and then the next second you two disappeared. What did you say to her? It's not about what I said to her, but what she does to everyone. She's a bully. She's conniving. She lost everything. It's not true. She's in the middle of a huge investment deal. Some kind of dance company in Europe. She's working on a Ponzi scheme. Turned back everything she lost. She used my dance company as collateral to forge new deals that paid cash up front. Oh, yeah, I see. This is about your dance company. You didn't know about her little habits, did you? Well, look where that got her. But. I don't know why she felt so lost when she was so close. Did you threaten her in any way? Stop defending Blake! so good to me. You escorted me all this way, and now I'm home safe. I wanted to speak to you in private, Blake. And this is Rebecca's place. It's not yours. Whatever. I can stay here as long as I want. Make yourself comfortable, I guess. How are you going to tell me you cut me from your little festival next year? Well, that's just business, honey. They didn't want to go with a season company, so I chose Jack Warner, the younger group. He is fresh, innovative, and very handsome. Do you even hear yourself? You're despicable. Don't be jealous. It's unbecoming of a seasoned professional. I guess I just wanted to hear it for myself. How do you live with yourself bulldozing everyone in your path? Doesn't everyone do that? No, not really. If you're so angry, why are you here? For 
heard about your little money problems. Everyone has money problems. Oh, and I stumbled into a lawyer for McDermott, Will, and Emery. What do you know about them? Enough to know that Jack Warner's looks weren't the reason you went with him instead of me. You know, Blake, you could have been more careful. They're under no obligation to be that confidential. Watch it, Claudia. You're treading in some dangerous waters. I'm done with your threats. I have clear intentions of my own now. You checked your email yet tonight? I would if I could find my... Ah, there it is. That law firm I know must know you're worth nothing. What? Son of a bitch. Jack Warner, he's exiting. Stage left. You didn't. This is a nightmare. You're ruining everything. Well, I'm on my way to LaGuardia to catch the last shuttle. I have a big meeting with new representation. You're a sociopath. I'm gonna destroy you. <laughs> Good luck with that. What? What is that? My, it's getting late. And you are getting tired. Since when did you start taking sleeping pills? What the fuck did you give me? I can't. I can't. Too many? And you may not wake up. I'm in the hospital, no thanks to you. What did you put in my drink? Claudia. What did you do? Something I should have done years ago. That's insane. I should have given her more. There would have been no questions now. You, you poisoned her? But we were, we were celebrating you. Celebrated me all night, and I plan on continuing to celebrate me. Claudia, you, 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 you don't have to do this. Becca, shut up. We can figure this out. Just, just, just give me the knife. You'll get this knife just for getting in my way, and so will you put your sister in the other room. <laughs> Blake called. She woke up. Don't worry, it's over now. I couldn't stop thinking about Bob. I know. Becca, I know. I couldn't, I couldn't go there. She's going to be fine. Now let's call 911 and get this trash out of our house. <laughs> 